Hey, welcome back to my channel. This is Motion Designer and in today's video, we're gonna create a very simple effect in After Effects. So let's get started. Okay, you'll be needing a footage and a screen recording of your phone. I'll just drag the footage and drop it here. And that creates a new composition. Hit Control K to change the composition settings and rename this main comp. And I'm gonna hit OK. Okay, so I'm going to track the motion, right? So go to tracker. If you don't find the tracker window, you can go up in the window and you can go and check this tracker, right? So I'm gonna select this footage and I'm not going to track the camera, but I'm going to track the motion, right? So I'm gonna select this track motion. That will bring up in a new window. So you will have a little tracker point. I'm gonna go and set this tracker point in the high contrast area which in my case is this one. I'm gonna adjust this. So make sure you set this at the beginning here and I'm gonna go just make some room. I'm gonna hit this analyze forward. So I'm gonna hit that and After Effects is going to track the motion as you can see here. So it's tracking it pretty nice and it's tracking it very good here as you can see here. All right, once this is done, you can see that you have a very good tracking so so what we're gonna do is we're gonna extract this tracking information and embed it or so to say paste it inside a null object right and then we're gonna use that null object to drive the motion of the screen so it's that simple so before i show you the process i want to talk about ae juice they are running an early black friday sale they are giving a 50 percent discount on all their products as you can see here it's early black friday sale all the links below are my affiliate link and if you buy from that there's no additional cost to you but help support the channel. Also check out my all-in-one bundle pack where you can grab it just for $10, right? So let's get back to After Effects. So let's go ahead and create a new null object. I'm gonna rename this tracking info and go back to the tracker. You can just select this edit target and I'm gonna select this null object that we have just created. Hit OK and I'm gonna hit apply and hit OK. So I'll go ahead and drag this Instagram screenshot or screen recording inside this new composition icon here. And I'm gonna go and select this rectangle, rounded rectangle tool without selecting any layers. I'm gonna double click on that and that will create a stroke. And I'm gonna go and set this scale to 95%. And what I'm gonna do is duplicate this and I'm gonna select and rename this one stroke and the other one to fill, right? So we're gonna select the fill and we don't want a stroke for this. So let's make the fill white and I'm gonna go and select this footage and select this and point it to the fill. Okay, let's just select this IG screen and maybe you can reposition it or whatever you want, right? All right, you're almost there. Go back to the main comp. So I'm going to select this IG screen pre-comp and drag and drop it inside the composition. And I'm going to go and scale it down, reposition it wherever you like. And I'm going to set this, select this and go to parent and parent it to the tracking information. And if you play it back now, it's gonna fall all like that, right? And you can change this blending mode to add or screen depending on what you want. And that is how easy and simple it is to create. I hope you learned something from this. So make sure to watch this video next. This is Motion Designer and I will see you in my next video. Take care. If you haven't followed us on Instagram, go follow us on Instagram and join the Telegram channel to get updated with upcoming tutorials and be a part of the Motion Designers community.